the men. There is a look at the NCAA records and the American record. And the defending champion set the NCAA mark last year, the Florida Gators, at 121-13. Third and final of the time finals. Indiana has set the standard in the second time final of 121-52. As we take a look at the SEC champion, Tennessee Volunteers shocked the conference about a month ago with a phenomenal race. Yeah, and, and this is a team that finished 17th last year. In fact, you've got four SEC teams in this final, so half the field right off the bat are SEC, and, and half the field finished out of the top eight last year, so a lot of changes here in 2023. And a look to the Florida Gators, the defending NCAA champions. The Gators, though, have never claimed this race back to back. And some familiar aces, we have Cheney and Leando, the bookends. Yeah, Cheney, the fastest split, one of the fastest splits in history on his back. He's the third fastest. He was 20.1 last year. Arizona State's going to be really good. They were six last year. They come in with the second fastest time in the country. Did we see it? Under 121? Would that be amazing? This is a race Arizona State has never won. Leon Marchand, the 200 breast NCAA champion and the NCAA record holder, holding the second leg. Five for the Sun Devils. Watch Seal up there right here. He has the fastest split in history. He was 20 flat last year. Could we see it? 19 in the backstroke. Wouldn't that be something? How about a 19? Let's see it here. Not quick. 97, 98 going out. Got a chance. Sealer of the Yellow Captain Lane 2. Cal with an early lane. Such as in 2029. 20.2. That's the fastest time right now. Florida was third at 20.3. Another 20.3 by Stokowski at NC State. Liam Bell in the water for Cal in lane two. Savickas in the water in lane three for Florida. Here comes Marshawn in five for Arizona State. He's going to grab the lead for the Sun. 22-2. 22-2. That's the fastest split in history, 22-2 for Marshawn. Now Max McCusker for Arizona State in lane five. Oh, if that's a sign of things to come, watch Crooks now. He's got the fastest in history for Tennessee. And Crooks has Tennessee fifth at the exchange, but they're about seven tenths behind. A little off what he went at SEC's 19-2 for Crooks. He did have the fastest split. No. Costanza hit the fastest foot, 19 1. Here comes Johnny Kulo for Arizona State in the lead. Driving forward is Leando. And the record! NC State closing for the NCAA mark. David Curtis brings it home in 1821 for a 120.67 for the Wolfpack. A shocker. It was a shocker. I mean, NC State, what a shocker. They were third last year. You knew they were going to be able to bring it. Curtis, 18-2. How about that 19-1 by Kurstanje? And then Hunter, 22-9, 20.3 for Stokowski. Fastest time in history. Patrick, that's 20 point one average think about that what they average 20.1 plus oh my god what a swim and it was north carolina state a team that we didn't talk about on the front half and they blew it out there are the heat three results look at that number first time ever a sub 121 and it 